weather we've been having causing financial woes for those who plow snow for a living. Many in the industry are struggling to survive at a time of year when their business is usually thriving. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaykad has a look at this impact. The absence of snow has been simply devastating for plowing companies who rely on performing these services to earn a living. In fact, the owner of one company says it's the worst he's seen it in nearly four decades. I feel good. No snow. Feels good. We don't have to shovel. We don't have to, um, our car is warm. For driving, I love it. Yeah, I mean, don't mind the roads. They're pretty nice. For many drivers across Metro Detroit, there hasn't been much to complain about in the way of road conditions this winter. Yet, not everyone is celebrating. John Baker owns Metro Detroit Landscaping, a company with more than 30 snowplow trucks and 40 drivers. So far this winter, he says his staff has felt salt in their wounds with no work to do. Just that the, they're not working, you know, not they're used to more hours before Christmas, and we've hardly done anything. I think we've salted three or four times. John says his competition is also feeling the financial hit. And while Michigan weather can deliver a sudden snowstorm. We've had years in the past where it didn't it come in, you know, they said come in like a lamb, go out like a lion. If this goes on much longer, he could lose drivers to other jobs and see this year's profits quickly melt. Until then, there is one thing he's been able to plow for practice. I plowed leaves, you know, <laughs> that's about it. Yeah, no, there hasn't been enough accumulating snow because we usually have like a two inch trigger. We just haven't had that kind of snow. The declining value of salt is also hurting snowplow companies who purchased much of it for $130 a ton. Another reason they say they're hoping conditions turn around this season. Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News. All right.